Okay. Uh, so every single one of us is extremely unique, but what does make us unique? Is it our thoughts, our consciousness, or is it our emotions? It doesn't really matter which one you picked because all of them are being controlled by our brain. The brain is the most complex object in the known universe. It is uh, made of very specialized cells called neurons that electricity flows through them. And there are more neurons in the brain than there are pages in the internet. And each one of them uh, talks to tens of thousands of other neurons, which makes the brain wiring at least 1,000 times more complex than the web. To understand how the brain works, we have to make a detailed map of its activity and wiring. However, the current technologies uh, either sacrifice providing a full picture of the brain or they sacrifice resolution. So we developed a technology that uh, equips each one of the neurons in the brain with a recording device that can record the activity and wiring of the neuron in the DNA of the cell. In addition to capturing the whole DNA picture and having a high resolution, it is very easy to use and it's inexpensive. Uh, so our technology is based on a newly developed CRISPR-Cas9 technology that is capable of writing on the DNA with single nucleotide resolution. We can program it to record the neural activity in the DNA of the cell, or we can program it to record wiring by giving each neuron a unique barcode that can get transferred to the adjacent neuron only if they are connected together. So now we want to use this technology to uh, map the neural activity and wiring in model organisms. Uh, we can uh, retrieve this information by doing a DNA sequencing and use this information to reconstruct the neural activity and wiring as it was in the brain. So our hope is to use this technology to study neurological diseases such as dementia, Parkinson's, Alzheimer's, uh, that are affecting over two billions of people in the world, and their treatments and diagnosis are based on guessing game largely right now. We have a question.